rationalizing denominators. times the square root of 6 to both sides to get a rational denominator. And that equals 4 to the square root of 6 over the square root of 36. And then, I don't know, multiply the fraction, which is... 4 square root of 6 over 6 and divide the common factor so you can divide this both by 2, divide that by 2, and divide that by 2, which gives you an answer of 2 to the square root of 6 over 3. And I wasn't supposed to divide that by 2. Common mistake. Don't divide the square root of this. So, scratch that, and it's equal to 6. Okay, so now we're going to uh, work on rational exponents. Okay, um, in the following exponent, um, x to the 4 over 5. Uh, 4 over 5 is the exponent. So since it's a fraction, we have to get rid of the, de the denominator so it could be a whole number. Okay, to do, to do this, we have to like move the denominator over to the square root. So 4 over 5. move the 5 over here. Okay, um, so, and uh, we keep the numerator with the x. So it looks like this. And uh, that's it.